stay in London. Gran came to stay. The children ran to meet her. Hooray, said Keeper. I love it when Gran comes to stay. She's good fun. Gran brought presents for everyone. She gave mom and dad an ornament. Keeper has a little golf club and Biff and Chip has a keyboard. Thanks, Gran, said everyone. It's another present for you, said Gran. She gave the children some funny looking parcel. What's the day? asked Keeper. Go around, said Gran. Children want, wanted to see how the boomerangs work. Gran took them outside. She threw a boomerang and whizzed through the air. Look out, shouted Gran. Keeper wanted to play with the ball club. Gran shot him what to do. She hit the ball, but she hit it too hard and it smashed a window. Oh dear, said Gran. Next day, Wilf, Wilma, Nadim, and Anina came to play. Biff and Chip showed them the keyboard. Gran had a good idea. Let's have a bed, she says. The bed make a lot of noise and the children have a good time. Whatever will Gran do next, said Dad. She's worse than the children, said Mom. Gran had promised to take the children on an out outing. She said that Nadim and Anina could go too. I take you all to London, she says. Look after Gran, said Mom as they got into the car. Try and stop her getting into trouble. We'll do our best. That bit, but it wouldn't be easy. When they go to London, Grant parked the car. Now we'll take the two, said Grant. It's the best way to get around. There were lots of people waiting on the platform. When the train came in, everybody rushed to go on. Now I know what isn't called a two, said Anina. Everyone gets squeezed. They went to Trafalgar Square on top of Colin was statue or of a Nelson. I wouldn't like to be up there, said Beth. I don't like heights. There were lots of pigeons in Trafalgar Square. Grand bought some nuts. The children feed the pigeons. Oh, how? said Nelly. I didn't know that pigeons were so greedy. They went to Buck Buckingham Palace. This is where the Queen lives, said Grant. It's enormous, said Anina. The Queen must be busy with all this room to clean. A big car drove past and everyone cheered and waved. The children couldn't see who was inside the car. Perhaps it's the queen, said Biff. Grant took them on a boat. They went under power bridge. The children were exciting because the bridge began to open. It began to rain and wind blew. Everyone felt cold. Never mind, said Grant. We'll think of somewhere warm to go next. They went to the wake work. What is a, a wake work? Asked Keeper as they went in. It had a wake model of famous people, said Anina. They looked at the model. Don't they look funny? Said Keeper. You can tell they are models and not real people, said Anina. Who are these people? Asked Keeper. That is Queen Bear. Victoria, said Grant, and some of her grandchildren. She had lots of grandchildren, said, said Nadine. Queen Victoria looked very fun. First, Fritz, said Beth. I bet she wasn't like you, Grant. Well, I wouldn't like to be a queen, said Grant. It must be a hard job. They looked at the Street sense. Sin. This is what London was like a long time ago, said Grant. 
A lot of people were very poor. Poor children didn't go to school in these days. They had to work instead. The grand that boy carrying brushed it a sweat. His job was to clean, climb up chimney and brush shoot down. Grand went off the to look at the royal family. While the children stay at the street scene, do you think Grand should go off by herself? Said Beth. She can't do much harm in here, said Chip. Grand dropped her handbag, and some money rolled among the mother. Grand went to pick it up. As she bent down, the down she knocked into the wagers, and they began to fall over. Grand picked the model up and put the head back on. The children couldn't believe it. Grand, what are you doing? said Beth. Don't just stand there, said Grand. Help me pick the model up be before anyone sees. Oh, Grand, said Beth. I let you out of my sight for a second, and this happened. They picked the model up and put the hat back on. They look strange, said Anna. I don't think the heads are right. Oh no, said Gran. A lady ran off. She was very cross with Gran. I can't think how you knocked the model over in the first place, she says. I never happened before. I'm very sorry, said Gran. I don't know. Said Bill. I don't think they will let Grand in the wave works again. Never mind, said Chief. Grand didn't mean to knock them over. Thank you for a great day out, said Nettie. We had never been to London before, said Keeper. I like the ride on the boat best, said Keeper. Even if it was cold, I like everything, said Anina. Home at last, said Gran. We can't tell Mom so of our adventures, but not all of them, and not the one about behinding the queen. The end.